I did like living on the council estate because you definitely get to see some unusual things. And I've got to be honest, sometimes they were taking place in my front garden and I was part of it. But I've gone out the front one day, what is it, about 11 o'clock at night in the dark because I just need to get something out of the car before I went to bed. And as I've got out there, someone's just walked past on the path with this long board on his shoulder. So I've watched him go by, I thought, that's odd, isn't it? 11 o'clock at night. So I've gone out to the roadside and looked down the road where he's come from. And what's taken place is that day, the council contractors have turned up all their scaffold equipment and they've laid it all down on this big grass birds because they're going to renew the roof tiles down that street and they've got to put the scaffold around the houses. And then when I look down there, there's several people walking about with scaffold boards on their shoulders. And there's just like, there seems a queue of them. And I thought, look at that, it's like some mad midnight builder's takeaway. <laughs> But that weren't the funniest thing I saw, because two weeks later, when the roofing contractors had turned up and they're busy putting new tiles on roofs, just along the road, one of my neighbours, I knew all my neighbours, and that they, they were related to some naughty boys that live around the corner. Well, they, they'd had their slates taken off, and they piled them all out by the front of their fence, because they're going to take them away, and, and they'd sell those, you know, get some money. And... Uh, and I just had that good fortune of just going out of my front gate just as their truck's pulling away because they go for a dinner bake apparently. And uh, I watch them go off and I'm just doing something. And then the two lads who live around the corner that are related to my neighbour, they've pulled up in a truck. Then they start putting all the slates in the truck. And I, I just had to get myself over there. I said, what are you doing? I said, no, they ain't coming back for another hour so we're having these ourselves. I said, that's a bit naughty. He said, oh, yeah, we don't, we don't, we don't matter, does it? And I'm all right. And then within like 10 minutes, they must have had, I don't know, 500 slates all wedged in the back of their van and off they go. And then, of course, I know these guys are coming back in about an hour time, so I made a point of being out there messing with my car so I can see their response. And they pulled up and it's, you know, where the slates all gone, because there's a massive great heap of them. Then they've gone indoors and I can see them having words and then... The neighbour came out and they said, well, we've been in there having our lunch. We don't know what's took place out in the street. And I thought, oh, well, there's a council estate. See you later. If you like listening to what I've got to say, do us a favour. Subscribe, ring the bell, make a comment, anything. Just let me know you're there. Thanks a lot. See ya.